How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. You may have seen last week we did our first video discussing Series 6, which is the next update coming to Horizon 5. We know a little bit about the update so far, we know the general concept of it, we have a few clues as to what's going to be within it. However, this is sort of an updated part to that video as quite a few things have changed and this update is looking a lot more exciting than we originally thought. If you do enjoy this video guys, please do consider subscribing to the channel, it helps me out loads. Let's get into it. One of the main ways we find out what is coming in the next update is having a look at the Coming Soon tab on the Festival playlist. Last week we had a look at what the Coming Soon tab said and it said this. It said that the next update was going to be Horizon Creatives. We covered the fact that what could Horizon Creatives be? And at the bottom it also says that the update's going to have new props, new collectibles, a new competition and a new story. Well, not long after that, this Coming Soon tab actually changed to this. Horizon Creatives, once again, new props, new collectibles, new events and new cars. That is different to what it was when we covered it last week. However, as many of you guys made aware in the comment section of my last video, it has changed again. It now says Horizon Customs and this makes a lot more sense. It still says we're getting new props, new collectibles, new events and new cars, but the main thing is Horizon Customs sounds a lot cooler than Horizon Creatives. Now if we compare it to the previous one that we covered, it doesn't say we're getting a competition anymore, which is a bit of a shame because quite a lot of you guys actually had your own opinion on what the new competition could be. And as we can see here, it just doesn't say that anymore, but we are getting some kind of new event, new cars as expected. Now we know that this is probably the final title for the next update. As always, let me know in the comment section below your predictions for this update. What do you think Horizon Custom means? Do you still think we're getting the new competition? What do you think it is in general? Let me know. Now you may remember in the last video we did actually talk about this update being a Tuners and Customs update because someone over on the GT Planet said that that was what the update was going to be about. Now we've seen that, that this coming soon page has changed to Horizon Customs. That's all looking very true and piecing together quite well. Based on the fact that we can now see it's Horizon Customs, we can now go back to these forum posts and see just what this update could be about based on some of the leaks that we've received over the past few weeks. A lot of people, and I mean a lot of people, want Rocket Bunny to return. And if it's my best guess, if we are going to see Rocket Bunny return at any point within the whole game's life cycle, and a Horizon Tuners and Customs update is the perfect update to add it into. So that will be very nice to see. Over the past several years with Horizon 4 and Horizon 5, we have quite often seen manufacturers and certain sort of brands removed from the game, such as Rocket Bunny, Tesla, Rolls-Royce, Toyota, Mitsubishi, quite a few things being removed, along with things being added, of course. But it is worth going back and just seeing how often do they re-add stuff to the game. Toyota ended up returning, Mitsubishi ended up returning. So just because things get removed from the game doesn't mean they can't be later re-added in the future, which means that seeing Rocket Bunny return is certainly a possibility, whether that's in the next update, the Tuners one, or one in the, near in the far future. I have seen a few people say our oh, Rocket Bunny was removed for a reason. Yeah, it probably was. That doesn't mean we can't get it added back again because it has certainly happened in the past. As for vehicles, we can go back and look at all of the leaked vehicles that we have found within the files of Horizon 5 over the past few months and see if we can spot any customs and tuner vehicles within that list that could potentially be the vehicles picked for this next update which is going to be a customs update. There's quite a few rod and customs vehicles found within the files, such as the 1957 Ford Thunderbird, Lincoln Continental and the Oldsmobile Tornado, and quite a few tuners vehicles as well, such as the Chevrolet Cobalt, the Dodge Stealth Turbo, the Ford Focus SVT, Honda CRX Del Sol, lots of people want that car, a Honda Civic Coupe, and the Mitsubishi FTO GP version R. Just a few examples of some cars which have been found within the files that aren't in the game yet that could match this update perfectly. And something else worth adding, as you know a couple of weeks ago we actually had the Series 5 cars leaked before the announcement which also included a few Series 6 cars as well. This included the McLaren 620R, the Mini Cooper John Cooper Works GP and the Oldsmobile Tornado, the one that was just mentioned a minute ago. So it's definitely not unrealistic to expect that the McLaren and the Mini may very well come to the game as per the accurate leaks. And the Oldsmobile Tornado as well, which does add up with the whole sort of 
rod and customs tuners update which series 6 is looking to be. And we must not forget about the unreleased leaked Barrett Jackson vehicles which were found once again within the files. The Barrett Jackson vehicles would again match up perfectly with a Horizon customs and tuners update. How many vehicles we're going to get in series 6 is unknown. So far we possibly know about three which means there is plenty room for more and the Barrett Jackson vehicles are certainly a possibility just because it adds up it makes sense. Now amongst the many comments which were on my previous video regarding series 6 I noticed this one right here. This was a guy that basically said that he wants Rocket Bunny to return but he also said that his game is in Polish presumably because he's Polish but he said that on his coming soon tab it says exactly the same as ours it says Horizon Customs new props new collectibles and then his third icon says new customization if you look on screen right now as you can see ours says new events but when you switch it to Polish and translate it it actually says new customization is this just a translation error or is this a sneak peek of what the new events actually means new customization it would all add up quite perfectly to be honest because you know if it's a tuners and customs update it's going to want to be quite tunery and new customization would fit that bill perfectly i reckon we should all join on on this if you are watching this video and let's say you are german spanish if you are anything other than english and you have your game in a different language i want you to go to your coming soon tab and see what the third one along says does it say new events in your language does it says new customization like it does in polish let me know maybe we can figure something out we have literally had this icon say three different things now it said a new competition it said new events and it said new customization which one is it going to be could it be all three and we're still getting a competition of some sorts i don't know but i want to know which one it is believe it or not with how time flies we are already nearly at the point about hearing about what's exactly within series six it's going to be a week maybe two around there so from all of this information we can narrow down what we think is coming in series six three vehicles which are very likely to come as per the accurate leak the McLaren the Mini and the Oldsmobile these cars here are also certain possibilities which match up with the rods and customs tuners thing the new horizon story which it did say we're getting now isn't there so are we getting a story probably not we're still getting new props and we're still getting new collectibles but anything after that we are unsure as per usual it goes back to saying we will have to wait and see Anyway guys, that's everything we have for today. This is just the updated Series 6 sort of expectations and predictions. If you have enjoyed this video guys, please leave a like if you've enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already for more content like this. I'll see you all later.